Okay, so here's exam three, uh, problem 12. And in this case, <clears throat> it said nine of 36 had type O. How do we report that? Well, um, certainly you got 9 out of 36 and that's 0.25 or, or 1 fourth or something like that but this is a random sample and and so the whole idea is it's a random number um, so what do I think the real answer is oh we need a, we need some sort of confidence interval and um, to some extent, in grading this, you know, I, I really didn't care what you used. Um, and so, now this is, um, N is 36, so that's a big enough sample, so you really don't need a, a T value, you can just use a, a Z value or, a, you know, normal distribution. Um, <clears throat> but so what I would report is, you know, something like 0.25, uh, plus or minus my, uh, in our technical term, is um, margin of error. Okay, well, what is that margin of error? Well, it depends on my confidence interval. So, you know, I'll use a Z alpha over 2 for some alpha. Um, and then uh, uh, times my... Um, sigma, so I will need a square root of uh, 0.25 times 0.75 uh, divided by uh, 36. So, um, what the heck's that number? Well, that's, that's uh, 1 fourth times 3 fourths uh, divided by 36. And that's all under square root. So, so really, that's uh, it looks like the square root of three over twenty-four. Because uh, I'll uh, yeah, because I'll get a four up here and a six down there. Um, so it looks like the square root of three over twenty-four, or whatever the heck that is. You know, so you you got a point two five plus or minus, and then you know you pick a reasonable number here. So. Like if you're going for a 95% confidence interval, that would be a one oops 1.96, and uh, times your square root of three over 24. Um, you know, so that's 95% confidence interval. Yeah, if you went with a 90% confidence interval, that number is uh, 1.645 um, times square root of three over 24.25 plus or minus. But that's the idea is you, you pick, you know, sort of the confidence you're going to give them for that margin of error. And, uh, and then you just compute that confidence interval that way. So that is uh, number 12.